We're rolling. My name's Carl. I'm a retired scientist from the Department of Interior and hiking the Appalachian Trail. And I learned about the Lyme disease problem along the Appalachian Trail. And it encouraged me to look into a little further and decided to do a study. I've got uh, a number of sites, 45 actually, along the trail, uh, from Georgia all the way to Maine. And I'm going to be collecting ticks at each location. And not just any location, but I, I'm interested in whether or not the shelters and the camping area around the shelters are a hazard as comparison to the trail. So I've, at each location of the 45, I'm going to be sampling along the trail. I'm going to be sampling within the shelter, and you can see what the shelters look like and also the tenting area around the shelter. And basically, I use a, a white flag, and I'm going to be dragging it across the surface, and the ticks will attach to the flag. I will then collect them and ship them off to a laboratory for analysis. Um, the three ticks of, of interest on the AT are the black-legged tick, which causes the vector of Lyme disease, the lone star tick, which we have more down here in the south, and also the American dog tick, which is uh, throughout the Appalachian Trail. All three of those ticks carry various diseases. And uh, follow me along the trail, and I'll be sharing some of the results as we go along.